So I've been doing some new plantings and I wanted to water them. So I put this under the drip line of the garage. And I collect these five gallon buckets full of water and then I cap them because hopefully that keeps the mosquitoes out. And then I got this idea because they want $100 for a rain barrel and I don't feel like spending $100 for a rain barrel. I had a water issue here where it would kind of pond here and because the slab kind of leans back into the garage and forgive the camera work since I can't really see the screen in the sun. I put on uh, these rain gutters, wild rain gutters, I hope they last, to move the water from this side over to this side of the garage. And I wanted a rain barrel. I had this old brine barrel. So what I did is I ran the gutter, as you can see, through a downspout. And this is uh, supposed to keep the leaves out of it. And that barrel, this is the overflow that I put on it. I haven't seen anything like this done, but if there is, then I guess I, I, uh, I don't know what you'd call it, zoomed in some, on somebody else's thoughts. So then I, I plugged the fittings on the side that were on this. Looks like that one's leaking a little bit. And then I put a spigot on the bottom. So we got an inch of rain, from what I understand, while I was gone, according to my range gauge, and that, and gauge, and that barrel's full. I think it's about 30 gallons. So, just another idea that I have not seen, and if I have, well, congratulations to the inventor. <laughs>